California needs livestock grazing for a variety of purposes. For one thing, Cal livestock in California remove approximately, this is a back of the envelope uh, calculation that a student of mine did, about 9 million tons of biomass, mostly dried annual grasses or annual grasses also not dried, but would also actually wind up as dried annual grasses if they weren't consumed by livestock, about 9 million uh, tons of that a year. And that is stuff that starts fires. Mm -hmm. It's also stuff that chokes out habitat for native species and for uh, um, for native vegetation. So for example, I, I went to a talk this year in my department. We were hiring some uh, biologists and one of them was an aquatic biologist and he showed pictures of a healthy coral reef. And there are these beautiful fish swimming around the healthy coral. Many of them are herbivorous. They swim around eating and gnawing on uh, algae all day, I guess, in these coral reefs. And then the next picture he showed, what happens if you take those fish away? And the whole thing becomes overwhelmed by algae. And I, I looked at that and I thought, oh my God, California is kind of in that state. We have this tremendous growth of vegetation. And a lot of that is related to the fact that our vegetation is not, it's a mix of vegetation that's been here and evolved here uh, with our wildlife, a uh, tremendous variety of wildlife with our native species. And a, a, a mix of that and plants from all over the world that have a similar uh, climate.